some Hooray. damn fables. Yay! Whoa. We are just gonna bang these out now. Second week yes, in baby. a row. Well, not second week for the listeners. Second week for us, and that's what matters. Anyway, uh, you guys are in a wagon. On, on your the way. Road again. Yeah. Yes. On, on your We're way on to Crossroads City. Can't wait to get trip. on the road again. Um. Yeah, it's probably. I don't remember what on I said before. Road. I think it's probably like a two-day journey to Crossroads City. <laughs> Um, you guys got anything you want to do while on this journey? We're anything you want to talk about? I'm playing music. I'm playing a song. Dora's playing a song. What song are you playing? I'm not playing it on my bagpipes. I'm playing it on my lute, whatever okay. it is I have. Anything else? Um, I don't know. I don't know. I... You know, it just might be a good time if you guys want I mean, to see any conversation. How do we just be like, oh, hey, Ingrid, tell us Dora's okay. backstory. Like, I mean, you can ask <laughs> her questions. I don't. So so is, a, okay, so is so Mara is asleep in the back. We That's why I'm like, I can skip front. ahead. I just. I like how you, you just said Mara's asleep. Playing. Like, we don't need Sarah in this scene. I mean, okay, that's I mean, fine. Is, is I'll just she, leave. Goodbye. I thought she Wake was up, asleep. Sarah, we you want you. Go to for sleep. <laughs> no, no. I only said Mara's asleep in the back because earlier I was joking that we were going to do the show by ourselves. Oh. Uh, <laughs> I see, I see. No, we're awake. We're but chilling. But she doesn't have to be asleep. Okay, we're Who's all, driving we're the wagon? Chilling. Me! Okay. I'm dragging the wagon. Um, this is like a covered okay. wagon. Yeah, it's a covered yeah. wagon. What's the road like? Um, it's a nice road. Check. You guys um, travel through the woods. That's like the first leg. It's oh, nice there's woods, there's though. There's it's not like... We go. It's not like creepy woods. Um, what did I call okay. these woods? <laughs> Hold on. Um, Sleepy Maple Woods. Sleepy Maple Woods. Um, that's what it's called. Okay. Um, you guys are Turn traveling. Sleeping Maple Woods. Food We've there. been here before. This is New Jersey. But you're in a different area. We're not in New Jersey. You're not in the New Jersey area. Um, okay. Oh, there. We're in a I different area. Yeah. You're in the um, northern all right. section. That's most of the journey, I guess, is the woods. Sleep Maple Wood. I don't know how to start a no, scene. No, I'm singing a, I'm singing a little song. I'm, you know. Yep. It's time to get moving. Time for us to have some fun. And it's no time to hang around. Our adventure's just begun. We'll be thinking about our friends as we chase the setting sun. But we're leaving them behind, we're on the run I don't care about what all the others say Well I guess there are some things that will just never go away I wish that I could say that there's no better place than home But home's a place that I have never known that's why we're on the run. That was so nice. That was I'll real nice. I'll a nicer version for you later, Shannon. Okay. That's a song from Steven Universe. Aww. Um, <laughs> um, Dora says that in World. It's a play I saw. <laughs> yeah, that's a song, that's a song from a, a play I saw, you know. Is um, that? It only has those two verses, so you know. It's nice. I mean, is that true? Do you have, like, what's up? You didn't write it, so it's not, like, autobiographical. Oh, no. No, no, no. Don't worry, man. No. All right. Um, I mean, kind of, if you stretch it, but, like, <laughs> you know. Is it true for you? No, I mean, I have my home. I just... You know, there's like a farm, and there's only so much you can do after a while. Yeah, I mean, how come you left? Uh, Ingrid, why would you ask me this before I figured it out? <laughs> 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 um, like, I've had a year, you know, that's not enough time. Um, You've got to be on your toes. Yeah, I, I don't know, I just sort of, my family is always just like, 
farming and doing stuff and I I love that I mean I have all my sheep and it's nice but they like never go anywhere and I just kind of wanted to see more places like my grandma was a traveler she's been all a bunch of places before she got to where I live so I don't know she used to tell me about right. it and it sounded nice so I just thought it would be more interesting okay. of a life I'm just kind of wondering man because like did you train before you decided to go on like a big journey um because you mean in like fighting like, and like, stuff like, don't get me wrong yeah well not just in fighting just like survival and that you know well i mean my family's druids so we do magic and stuff well that's wow that's cool man yeah i mean we have i mean i know like all my family does like magic and everything, so I just kind of grew up with it. Oh, that's so cool, man! I did not. That is nice. Nah, I was not. I was like, I was not like expected to do sort of magic stuff. But magic stuff is like so cool. So why wouldn't you? Yeah. Kind of thing. Do you get me? Yeah. What about you, Mara? <laughs> Um. <laughs> well, I mean, <laughs> we know about the assassin cult because yeah, it's all you talk so about. So I was, uh, I talk about other things. I know. I'm. Ta- I'm. I mean, about your past. It's all yeah, you talk I about. I mean, that is my. That's all my past was. I mean, I'd say I was pretty aggressively trained from birth in um, murdering yeah. people. Yeah. <laughs> Hang on. While we're okay, paused, not I need in to get that, my charger you know. on my laptop. What do you mean while we're paused? We're not paused. You were in the middle of a sentence. No. Sarah has paused us. Mara has left the building. Mara was like, hold on. Mara was like, yeet, and just jumped out of the way. (laughs) She's like, I am not interested in this conversation. Why? Mara's like, I'm not talking about my past. Well, no, I was just, I thought the conversation was over. I didn't realize there was going to be more talking about Mara. There's more talking about everyone. Oh. We're on a two-day journey. Ugh. Talking. Ugh. <laughs> That's just smart. I mean... Yeah, no, Sarah okay. loves talking about herself. I'm terrible, honestly, guys. Don't be friends with Let's, me. You know, Mara, I did kind of... No. I don't remember if you told us, but, like, what... What was it that got you to leave? Because it seems like they had y'all pretty brainwashed and... What a good question, <laughs> Sarah says. Well, none of us, like, I wasn't prepared for Dora interrogating me, so you welcome uh, to hell. <laughs> God, what would have made Mara leave? I don't, Mara's for whatever reason, I've never thought about this. Or, or if I did have the thought, my memory is terrible and I don't remember it. This is Sarah talking. This is Sarah talking. This is not Mara. You can tell because I sound confused. <laughs> Well, you can just be like, like, I don't want to talk about it. Oh, yeah, we'll just, yeah, let's just, I, Mara just doesn't want to talk about it. All right. And tell Sarah That's fair. That out. Kids. What about you, Dora? What's what? up? Like, I know you were, you were doing the traveling musician oh, uh, thing, right? Yeah, 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 yeah. I mean, that's just like, you know, the sort of chill existence, you know, I'm just like chilled out and stuff. Like a like a cool person, you know, like someone who's cool. You are cool. Um. Oh man, thanks. I don't think anyone has ever called me that before. So like, but nice. Nah, you're. I mean, maybe. Uh, this is now weird because I just realized. Sorry, out of character. Sarah just date, started dating someone called Sunny, and that's the name of someone in Dora's. Background. Oh yeah, that's Dora's ex girlfriend. We knew that already. <laughs> I noticed that when I was updating my list yeah. of characters, I was like, "Well, I am." Oh, by the yeah, way, no, listeners, but, um, I've started dating a Sunny. It's great. Yes. Sarah, not Mara. Not Mara. Mara's already dating two people. She doesn't need to date anymore. Too She's not really effort. dating them. She just kind of loves them from afar. <laughs> I would say that she is dating Lauren. Yeah, yeah. But they don't go on dates. Um, 
Yeah, no, I mean, maybe at some point Sonny did, but probably in, like, a laughing way. Yeah. Would we have talked about who Sonny is before, or this is the first time I've heard? No. No, who's, no, who's this Sonny? is the first Sonny? time <laughs> Oh, just, like, some girl I knew, I don't know, she was, like, cool and shit. Oh, uh, actually, fuck, I think she went to Crossroads City, so... <laughs> Let's not hope she's about. Uh, y'all didn't um, end on good terms. <laughs> no, I mean we were fine. I just, you know, um, don't want her to meet you. <laughs> Why? I'm offended. We're friends. Are you no, embarrassed no, no, to be no, seen no, with I us, just... Dora? No, I'm not embarrassed to be seen with you. From the you. back of the wagon. She's just I'm like, embarrassed to be seen with you guys. Marty, what? <laughs> Come out here to have this conversation or don't. I forgot Marty was here. <laughs> that is both Sarah and Mara simultaneously. Martin McFly shades. <laughs> Big shutter shades. Respect your parents. Um, no, she's just kind of like intense. Um, and like... I don't know, weird, like, you know, kind of, yeah, I don't know, I just feel like, I just feel like she might, like, tell you some stuff, and that would be bad, yeah. Some stuff? And, like, well, like, try and make me look bad and shit, and, like, embarrassing stories, you know, that kind of thing. Uh-huh. It's, you know, it's not that brush. It's not that deep, man. Don't worry. All right. <laughs> uh, Dora starts singing and playing again. <laughs> <laughs> okay. okay. Uh, that's really good. Um, so, while you're on your way to Crossroads City, this is a good time to tell you guys about the war. Because I don't know if it'll come up, but it might oh, come gee. up because you're going into the city. Uh, um, and Ingrid already knows some of this because we have discussed. Oh, I do. It. Yeah. Yes. So basically, um, I I made up some of yeah. the characters. <laughs> well, you didn't so much make them up as you decided who they were. <laughs> I was like, "Hey, this is a thing," and you were like, "Yes, yes, yes it is." Okay, so Valencia, the kingdom that you guys are in, is at war with Carterton, which Ingrid did name Carterton. Um, which is the kingdom to the Shout north. Shout out to Roxy Justice. Yeah. Um, that is the kingdom to the north. Um, so above the mountains. But, like, kind of between the two kingdoms is, like, the orc lands. Okay. Which isn't really a kingdom. It's, like, the orcs tribes. Um, so these two kingdoms mm-hmm. have been at war for a few decades now. Um, probably, like, all of your entire lifetimes. Um, the, um, so Carterton is ruled by a queen, and, um, she is an elven woman, and she has, she has a husband and two children, and they are the Smith family. (laughs) The Smith family. Not Peggy Carter? They're, they're, they're Jada Pickett Smith and Will Smith and Jack Smith. Oh my god! But that's what that's what they are. Um, oh as my decided god! Smith Andrew. family. Um, if you hey, I mean, I think the character Lucas Grayville. So. I mean, that doesn't have to be their names, but if you guys are well, no, I that's think their, their names. names can be J- Jada and Will and Willow and Jada. Yeah, they like, they probably have some other last. They name. don't have to have last names. They don't have to have yeah. last names. It's true. Um, yeah, so that's the family. Um, but no. <laughs> I think literally Shannon was like, who's like a very sort of, what's a sort of very prestigious elf style name? And I was like, Will Smith. Yeah. <laughs> um, no, I think I was listening to Willow Smith at the time as well, so. There you go. There you go. Um, so, yeah. Uh, I guess you guys. Well, I was like, should um, you guys, like, roll to decide how much history you know? But then again, Dora would know a lot of it. So I guess 
Yeah. I guess we are on Ripley. Roll history. Okay. I mean, I didn't even know we were at war. Ripley probably did, but... Sarah. I'm rolling history. I'm checking on what my number would be. Um, Plus three. Where is my... A 12. Okay, 17. I I figure Mara knows there's a war because she was told there was a war. Um, But the information she received about the war is all highly suspect. Mm -hmm. There is no war in Mm Bosnia. Yeah, Mara, like, knows there's a war and... Knows that part of her training was... To fight in the war. To fight in the war. But... She doesn't... Dora was in the war, right? Yeah. She doesn't necessarily... Mara doesn't necessarily know, like, what she was... To I think do what side necessarily. Yeah, and I think Mara, any information Mara has received about the war, she has completely disregarded because she doesn't yeah. know if it's true or not, and she'd rather find out from someone else. So you probably know basically what I just said. Um, Ripley would know a little bit more. Ripley especially, you know, lived at the edge of the mountains, so... Mm-hmm. We're um, not at war. We're just chilling. No, you're not at the war. That's the war definitely happens more in the north and around the orc tribes and stuff. The orcs have all kind of split off. Did you say why we're at war? Did sides. I miss that? No. Um, I just did not say. Um, the orcs um, tribes as, but I think uh, clans is a thing because we were like taking from Scottish stuff yeah. more than yeah. like anything else. Um, because they're going to be Scottish. Yeah. <laughs> Uh, the, well, the druids are Italian, so... That is the reason being. <laughs> They're at war, basically, um, over land disputes. Um, kind of... I think both kingdoms kind of just want the the area that the orcs live in to, like, be their land. And the orcs are not yeah, on either side, or just whose kind side of like, are the orcs on? Um, the orcs, the different fish. clans are fighting on different sides, um... Or just against both sides. Mm -hmm. It's not just like, oh, the orcs are with them. Okay. The orcs aren't ruled by one side. It's us versus the Will Smith family. And there are also orcs. And there are also orcs. Okay. Um, I'm caught up to speed. Yes. Uh, So, the Carterton for a long time was, like, winning the war. um, And that was partially due to, like, the prince... Jaden, I guess. Jaden! Um, he was like a speaker, and he went around and gave a lot of cool speeches. I mean, that um, tracks. Accurate. Yeah. Let me, um... um and he, so... Exactly. However, at some point, he, um, within the last, like, five years or so, he, like, fell ill and has not really gone out in public since then. And since then, the war has started to veer more towards Valencia. We're gonna okay. read some gonna, choice um, quotes from the Prince of Carterton. <laughs> some, yeah, some from some of his speeches. I will always give you the truth. I will never lie to you in my music. If you can't handle my feelings and emotions, please unfollow me. I need, I need like wind chimes to to play at each of these. Dying is mainstream. Hashtag money. <laughs> I'll never forget the blogs that believed in me since the begging. <laughs> Most trees are blue. What? <laughs> I hope it doesn't take for me to die for you to see what I do for you. That was a great speech. A lot of people were really into that one. Lately, people call me <coughs> Scoop Life. <laughs> Prince Scoop Life. <laughs> it's your birthday, Mateo said. I didn't respond. Are you not excited to be 15, he asked. Reading my book, I uttered, I turned 15 long ago. <laughs> This is quite a prolific. Yeah, so he gave a lot of... <laughs> wait, wait, one more, one more. If newborn babies could speak, they would be the most intelligent beings on planet Earth. <laughs> or planet, right. whatever planet we live on. In the country of Carterton. Um, yeah, so then um, Valencia, of course, is Wait, ruled wait, by there's another one. There's Heather, another really good Heather. one. I have to say it. The Great Gatsby is one of the greatest movies of all time, Coachella. <laughs> Trees are never sad. Look at them. Every <laughs> once in a while, they're quite beautiful. Um, when I die, then you will realize. <laughs> okay, we're done. Okay, we're done. We're done. It's the a prince, rabbit hole. The prince is sick now. He can give no more speeches. <laughs> uh, Valencia is ruled by Queen Heather Clearcloud, um, and she has a niece, Hanalore Clearcloud. Hanalore. Hanalore. 
Oh my god, Hannah Law after QC? Well, you you no, you, you named her many many months ago. Oh, I ago. named her after QC. So yes. Okay, nice. <laughs> um Hannah Laura's parents died long ago. I like that we have now have ever. characters that were named a year ago named Hannah Laura and Sunny. Yeah. Um, yeah. Uh, wow. So, yeah. Um, and Queen Heather and Princess Hannah Laura, of course, live in Crossroad City, where you guys are headed. Oh, good. So. The Queen. Does she um, look like Heather from Crazy Ex-Girlfriend? No. Oh, I'm sad. <laughs> she definitely does not. Um, she's old. Does she look like the old lady on the bench from Crazy Ex-Girlfriend? Maybe. <laughs> <laughs> I am the woman. <laughs> the woman is me. She looks like the Heather on the bench, and Hannah Lowe looks like... <laughs> Heather. <laughs> Heather. Uh, no, they don't look like Heather because I already have dolls made of them. And wow. Um, okay. In fact, let me just go into my doll folder so that I can... Shannon has dolls of every oh, character. We cannot good. head kid in them any other way. Um, but Hannah Laura <laughs> is very pretty. Um, okay. I'll be the judge of that. So Do you want me the doll? See? Okay, well, I'll message it to you instead I'm of... I'm gay. Because we would have seen paintings of our queen somewhere in the world. Yeah, I don't have... Okay, I don't have a doll of mm. Queen Heather because um, they don't make you, let you make old people, you know, but... Uh, so why makers. can't Queen Heather look like Heather on the bench? Because she doesn't. This is what Hannah Lore looks like. Um, I don't there see any is. message oh, from she's you. she's pretty. Oh, it's wait. In, in hangouts. Why is she so sad? Um... She's all right, I guess. I'd give her a three out of ten. Okay. <laughs> three out of ten. <laughs> that's so low. Jesus. Um, she just looks too fine. sad. She's a little bit sad, you know? And maybe we'll find out why soon. Wow. She's um, got the Chan So we're mall. totally going to find out why soon. <laughs> yeah, the Chan. She's played by Chan. <laughs> um... Okay, so... I mean, Chan does kind of have that hair now. Um, Crossroads City is shaped like a cross... And, and there are roads. <laughs> and there's four roads leading into it. Hence the crossroads. You guys are going to enter the city through the southern gate. Um, with no problems because it's just daytime and you can just go into the city. One can um, simply walk into Crossroads City. <laughs> there, there are, like, guards there, but it's, like, whatever. Um, uh, so the city is surrounded by walls. Um... And you, in the shape of a cross. In the shape of a cross. Um, not, like, super high walls, just, like, city walls. Um, so you go into the city. It is a bustling city, medieval city. This is how I describe cities. <laughs> um, mm-hmm. So it's basically kind of split into four sections. And the music sections. from Barbie Rapunzel plays And the music from Barbie through. Rapunzel plays. And... Um, <laughs> The castle is in the center of the city. It would take you a little bit of time to get there, but, um... Yeah, so here... And it's the pink castle from the bar. <laughs> sure. Yeah. Um, so here you are. Uh, so here we are. Yeah. I don't know. What do we do? Get... Well, what... Weren't we waiting for Robin to tell us where to go? Well, you gotta call Robin out. Get Robin out. It, well, can we go? Can we like go to a, a tavern first? I'm gonna be in character actually because we should have this conversation in character. All right. Can we go somewhere first because I don't want to just get Robin out in the middle of the street. Well, yeah. Like then kind of draw attention. No, so. I'm. That's not what I meant. But yes, smart. Let's do it. <laughs> Let's find. I mean, we have to find where we're gonna like stay. <laughs> Because Catherine doesn't live here. We can't just camp out with her again. <laughs> yeah. I mean, we could stay in the wagon, but we need somewhere to put it. So, what are you guys looking for? Thoughts from I'm the sorry, peanut I gallery. Completely... Okay, I guess we go, we go and try and find somewhere to stay, right? Yep. Yeah. Let's do it. Okay, we're looking around, Shannon. 
Um, well, what what are you looking we're still for? On the wagon. A place to stay. Okay, I guess we're all an investigation. An check. inn or some kind of hotel or something. <laughs> some kind of five star resort that we can't afford. I got a five, six. <laughs> Mara, are you Mara, you're our only to wow. stay. You got one more. Nope. What am I supposed to be rolling for? Investigation. Investigation. Oh, that's right. Sarah's shopping for bras. I am. I got a note that's like, oh, only 16 hours left for our buy one, get one 50% off sale. And I was like, shit. I, I think we're just going down the street and there's 20. a bra seller in the street. And they're like, only 50, 15 hours, buy one, get one 50% off. What's and Mara's you get? like, like ooh. What'd you get? 20. Uh, you got a 20? Yeah, not a nat 20. 17 plus 3. Okay, well, 20. let me just double check what our boy got. I just, like, look, place. Um, I boy got 14, but... Um, place. So, Mara points at, place. A, at a beautiful <laughs> inn and is like, place. <laughs> um, Let's stay there, guys. What's the name of this inn hotel? Oh, um, um... Welcome to the, the Lemon Lodge. California. <laughs> I don't know why. That was one of the bad names that Alexis and I were saying in our quest to come up with every name so that we should not name our house. Points. Social goat in bed and breakfast. So Mara points <laughs> and is like, place. <laughs> and you guys, Dora and Ripley both turn and see a place called the Lemon Lodge. And they're like, that sounds nice. And Mara's like, no. <laughs> next to it. And then next to it is a beautiful building. And it's the Hotel California. <laughs> um, Why are we going oh to the God. Hotel California? <laughs> because that's what I started singing. Um, I know, but you don't go there. You never leave. <laughs> oh, whatever. You can check in anytime you like, but you can never leave. Um, no, so we're, wait, 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 wait. Before we see the Lemon Lodge, we're going down the street, and it's like, how about this place? <laughs> the Lotus Hotel. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, I'm sure that's irrelevant. <laughs> and then Lucy pops up and is like, no. <laughs> In the Odyssey. <laughs> a lotus flower. Okay. Sorry. Um, the only thing that's consistent about this show <laughs> is referencing the Percy Jackson musical. Yeah. <laughs> so you guys pull on up to the hotel and you park the wagon in their parking garage. <laughs> <laughs> the parking garage of the and Hotel California. you stroll on in and you pay for a room. How much money do you guys have? How much money do you have, Mara? I, I have, have none. You I have, have money some money. And Marty has I have money. 224 money. Okay, that's plenty. It's probably like... That's plenty. I'll take it all. <laughs> yeah, I'll take all of it. Uh, it's probably like 50 gold a night. Let's say that. That's a lot of money. Yeah, For we can just sleep in the wagon. Stuff. Yeah. Uh, how much is it? Well, I don't know what the residency, sleeping in your wagon, how that's viewed upon a cross from the city. Uh, how much is the Lemon Lodge next door? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I just don't know how long we're going to be staying here. Yeah, 50 gold It's going to compare prices. <laughs> Let's go over next door. Okay, so you there's guys, a hotel you guys go over the Lemon Lodge. Mara's, like, Mara's, Mara looks, Mara, Mara gets... They're like, it's 50 gold a night. And then Mara goes, okay, let me check. Let me okay, check with my husband. That. And then just no, 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 goes no, no, no. out. So what it is goes. is, let me check with my husband and I'll call you right back. She looks over and Marty's just like, what? <laughs> 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 so you hop on over to the lemon lodge. There's a bowl of lemons sitting on the counter. That's gay. <laughs> and, um, Very good. <laughs> Why is a bowl of lemons gay? <laughs> The room needed a pot yes, of color. Yes, up to the yeah, counter. The room Nicole. The needed to put them there. Oh. <laughs> She's gay, so. You okay. stroll on up to the counter and you ask how much a night is, and they're like, five gold. What nice. <laughs> Let's stay here and not get out <laughs> sketch, but we'll stay five here gold. instead. Sounds great. Who is this lemon lunch? Would you like a lemon? <laughs> yeah. Yes, please. Sure. <laughs> Take the whole bowl. Put bowl of lemons in your in your <laughs> bowl. <of lemons>. No. <laughs> Robert, we need more lemons on the counter. Stat. <laughs> Wait, what? I said Robert. We rabbit. Need more... <laughs> rabbit. Robert. Oh, the so first time that popped into my head. <laughs> Marie, the baguettes. Hurry up. Um, <laughs> all right. He hands you a key okay. to a room. Sweet. And is like, it's down there. Um, <laughs> let's go. A room with five beds in? 
No. How many beds are there, You Shannon? just asked how much is one room. I we have... said five gold, and he handed you a key. <laughs> well, let's see. It's two beds. I mean, if we have oh to get God. a room per person, it's still going to be less two... than the Hotel California. Um, real talk. It has, okay, it has Friends. two beds, so who's going to share with who? Has Mara ever seen a lemon before? I don't know. <laughs> Roll, <laughs> for lemon. Roll for lemon investigation. <laughs> I mean, would Roll. pirates would have lemon. I don't know. Would pirates have seen a lemon, lemon before? <laughs> it's a lemon. But it's like when you were like, can Mara read? It was no. like, yeah. That was <laughs> that guy. Oh, I I'm to, trying to decide okay, I need to if it that. would be statistically likely for Mara to just bite into the lemon. No. Like it's an apple. She would have <laughs> seen an orange <laughs> before at any rate or some sort of citrus fruit. <laughs> I want to roll for lemon recognition. All right, my name's Laura, and I never fucking learned how to read. Or I don't know what a lemon is. Roll intelligence, Sarah. <laughs> to know if this, to know what this lemon is. I got a 21. You know what a fucking lemon is. <laughs> oh my god! <laughs> Make it to your room. What is the room look? There's, it's okay. There's Sarah, okay. eat your lemon. It's okay. I need to go get a drink of water. I'm gonna keep describing the room. Okay. There's That's two fine. twin size beds. Okay. Um there's a dresser. Uh-huh. And there's a little Two um, twin size beds. Yeah. Dora wants to do like, a you of who has to share the bed in the I'm, hotel room. I'm, I'm, and there's there's sitting on the dresser, this is the only furniture. There's um a little brochure that's like, Welcome to Crossroads City. Lovely. And it's all the tourist stuff to oh, do. Oh, let's look at the brochure. City. In the brochure, there's, you know, a lot about okay. oh, the castle. Crossroads City is a great place to live. Um Queen Heather is the best ruler we've ever had. <laughs> is this Disney World? <laughs> I said that about Fairgate, but... Our sister city, Fairgate, is only two days south from here. Um, no, it doesn't say that. Uh, yeah. Um, all right. Okay, so... Now take Robin out. gets to sleep in beds? Okay, okay, I'm taking Robin out. <laughs> Ingrid is very concerned about Ingrid the beds. Ingrid really wants to share beds. It's midday, so you're not sleeping. No, yet. Well, I there's don't. two beds, I'm, then Rip no, was two beds. Share. Oh, well, then... This is the but, lemon lodge. But we <laughs> rock, we we rock, we're paying five bucks a night. <laughs> we rock, paper, there's scissors, no spare pillows. Sleep on the floor, it's fine. We can sleep on the floor. I have sheep. I'll the just sheep use my sheep as a pillow. <laughs> <laughs> Not a mattress. I just mean okay. I'll cuddle with them. Jesus. Okay, you take Robin out. Okay, you've probably. <laughs> yeah, I take Robin out. Robin comes out. Yeah. <laughs> what was that? It's Robin coming out of there. Coming, coming out, out of, of their cage. It's and they've been guys. doing just fine. Gotta, gotta, gotta get, get down down because down. because he wanted all. Can Robin sing that every time that's, they come that's out? That's what Robin sings every time they come out. <laughs> it's like the waking up song. We just don't talk about it. Hello. <laughs> hey, Robin. We made it to uh, the city. So oh, excellent. So, um, what now? All right, so I have been trying to narrow down where in the city that the spinning wheel might be. And um, I have good news and bad news. All right. The good news is I know where it is. Okay. The bad news is it is in the castle. I'm shocked. <laughs> Oh, so Fuck not no. sure what you guys are gonna do about that, uh, but I believe in you. Well, let's hope the princess doesn't yeah, touch thanks. it. <laughs> well, um, I didn't actually say that. <laughs> okay. Any other questions for Robin? All right. Matt. I mean, do you have any like? Ideas for us about how to go uh, about tips. getting uh, to it? Well, I would be very careful because the castle is Will this include gone. disguises? Yeah. I mean, that's up to you. <laughs> Wait, hold on, guys, guys, guys. This is the genie and we still haven't used our wish. We just live out the plot of Aladdin. <laughs> <laughs> 
Sorry for screaming in your ear. So fine. I mean, we just um, Dora becomes Prince Ali, (laughs) and huh? No, that's not necessary. I have the head of disguise. You do have your head of disguise. Why do we need a disguise? disguise. Why do we have any reason to believe that we can't just like go talk to the people? Be like, hey, your your spinning wheels is a yeah, weird I mean, thing. Maybe you like, should go talk to some people first. I mean, maybe ask is it so? Out. Do you happen to know? Are they very possessive of the spinning wheel, or could we just go in and be like, hey, we have reason to believe that your spinning wheel is possessed by a demon spirit, and you should probably dispose of it. <laughs> <laughs> well, I, I don't personally know the queen uh, or the princess. Um, <laughs> Never met them. Don't know how possessive they are of their spinning wheels. Uh, All right. I think that Queen Heather is possessive of her things. But, but is she possessive of things that are possessed? Um, yeah, I have no idea. All right. Well. And I don't know if the 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 spirit uh, has revealed himself. Okay. So perhaps nothing bad has happened yet. Uh, why we don't we hope. just, like, <laughs> arrange a meeting? Why don't we... Okay, I don't know if this is the sort of city where they wait, have Wait, you. wait, 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 I mean, well, look in the brochure and see if there's, like, castle tools or something. That's a good idea. Are you looking oh, the damn. brochure? <laughs> Thanks. I was, See, I was this just, fucking cat boy was here the one time listen, that my ideas weren't good. They've he, been good the whole time. He was like, he just didn't understand that, like, you can't the have all hits. Like, sometimes, occasionally, you have a miss, but we've been having a lot of hits, so it's all right. <laughs> also, <laughs> he didn't like my sheep, so I'm not really sure what I think of him anyway. Um, are you guys looking in the brochure? <laughs> yeah, we look in the brochure. There are no uh, castle tours that you see, but um, there is an event happening later, well, I guess all day, um, today. It's, uh, well, not really an event, just kind of like a farmer's market. All right! Uh, the, outside of the castle, in front of the castle. Um, all right. We should go see if their peppers oh, are quality, because I could get them a better supplier. Uh, my family's peppers are real nice. <laughs> I I don't know if I ever right, said well, this. I don't know if I ever said this on the recording, but in Italian, pepperoni means peppers, like bell peppers. It doesn't mean pepperoni. And so I decided that since Mrs. Shepherd's name is Mrs. Shepherd because she was a shepherd, that Ripley Pepperoni's family is named Pepperoni because they are pepper farmers. Excellent. I love it. Very good. Um, okay, you guys going to the farmer's market? Yep. Are you guys taking the wagon or are you just walking? Yeah. Um, I say we just walk, but the sheep are coming. Okay. So, okay, we'll lock up the wagon. Yeah. All right. Um... In the Lemon Lodge. So you oh, move it from we forgot the- to ask Robin if there were any updates from Mr. Robot. <laughs> oh, well. Domo arigato, Ooh. Mr. Robot. No, no it's update. <laughs> Domo arigato, um, Mr. Robot. You guys move the, the wagon <laughs> from the, the valet parking of Hotel <laughs> California to the just the back the little- alley of the Lemon Lodge. Yep. Um... All right, you guys. We should probably put our, our nice stuff, like, in the room and log it. Yeah. Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. So we do that. Okay. Um, so you guys... Okay, and now we're walking through Crossroads City. You're walking through right. Crossroads City. Um, like I said, it's a bustling city. Lots of very tall buildings. <laughs> I um, thought you were going to say lots of really tall way. people. Lots I of really gonna... tall people. <laughs> I mean, good. Dora and Ripley I fit and Dora in. Dora are like, ooh... I mean, Marty's kind of tall, yeah, but not as tall as you guys. Uh, yep, um, you guys, unless you so guys no cat boys to be seen around some, here. No cat boys. Um, lots of humans and elves. Um, no like gnomes. Um, you don't see a lot of orcs. Are there any orcs? No, I don't think you see any orcs. Do you, um, does Dora get a lot okay, of looks cool. on Do the street? You, um, I think maybe Dora gets a few looks, but not like, whoa, what's an orc doing here? Just kind of like, oh, there's an orc. Um, you know, don't see a lot mm-hmm. of those. Uh, yeah, mostly humans and elves. Um, 
So you get to there's like a courtyard in front of the castle, and there's a farmers market going on there. Mm-hmm. Um, yeah. All right. Let's. What are you guys doing? We're going into the farmers market. Okay. We're going into the farmers. So market. you're gonna look around. So there are farmers um, market things. I go look at the peppers, and I'm like. Mm. In, roll an investigation check for the quality of the peppers. <laughs> um, 14. They're okay. They're all right. Yours are better. Can you I know. make a perception check, please? Yes. What are you trying to perceive? Just to see if there's anything going on that's suspicious. Okay. Don't be suspicious. Don't be suspicious. Don't be suspicious. I rolled... A 15. A 15. Um, you notice a young woman, like a teenage girl. Um, hold on, I'm trying to find my doll. Wait, 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 wait. Did anyone, who saw the creepy people? Just Mara? Yeah, just Mara. You didn't tell anyone about that? No. Okay, that tracks. Um, this woman, this young girl who is like, Seems to be arguing a little bit with um, one of the guards at the, like, castle gates. How young, girl? Like, probably, like, 17. Mm. Okay. Like, younger than you guys. So not, like, Avery. Bet. Not like Avery's age, no. Um, she's got a basket of bread. Um, the bread with okay. very curly um, hair. Well... It just seems a little odd. Well... Well, Rippers is... is talking, t- like, the discussing pepper, pepper quality. Mm-hmm. Um, presumably, Marty and Mara are looking at whatever they have in the way of weaponry. <laughs> you know, at the farmer's Mara, market. Mara got distracted by the um, courses. Mara's looking You know, at, at the farmer's market. Oh, yeah. Did Mara say what Mara's looking yes. at? Mara's looking at paper. Yeah, Mara, what's Mara's, Mara's looking like at? writing paper for At the letters. farmer's market? I was Aww. joking about the corsets and the weapons. It's yeah, like a handmade pepper seller. Pe- not pe- paper, paper seller. Sure. You're looking Peter at a paper seller. Peter pecked a peck of pickled that's, papers. That's really cute. That is cute. That's oh, very and the cute. welcome wagon is there. <laughs> Yay! Mrs. Cowgill! Hey! I have... Some money. We have the same amount of money that we had when yeah. we spent it the last yeah. time we were at but the just, welcome you know, wagon. If you get some more money, welcome wagons there. Um, okay, so while everybody's um, looking at stuff. Yeah, so while while everybody's looking at stuff, I kind of step a bit closer, but trying not to be that noticed, I just want to hear their conversation. Okay, um, roll a stealth. Check. Is there a check that would be like okay. listening to a conversation, not just like trying to go unnoticed? I don't know. Perception? Yeah, I mean, I mean, investigation. Yeah, I mean, I guess you can roll investigation again. Well, not again, but well, yes. I did investigation. Okay. okay. <laughs> Okay, I get a two. You got a two. So you really, you can't hear any of their conversation. Um, what if I go closer? <laughs> well, you're trying to go unnoticed, right? How are you? Yeah, I'm like pretending to look at some fruit. So you're pretending to look at some fruit, and you realize that's not close enough. You can't hear them. So I guess um, roll a stealth check. To try to get closer. Okay. Without being suspicious. Don't, Don't be suspicious. suspicious. Don't, Don't be suspicious. suspicious. Okay, that there you go. I've got a, a, a 19 in that one. Okay, so how do you Damn. go about... Because I got a 17. How do you go about sneaking closer? You tell me. Well, I, I take the fruit and I'm like, no, nah, this is, this is, oh, oh, this is all bruised. I don't like it. And you, sir, are a fool. <laughs> and then I walk past the girl and the guard to a stool that is closer, but, like, I've gone past them. Okay. So it's not like I'm just trying to get closer. Okay, so you hear a little bit of their conversation. The girl is being like, um... Oh, what's the girl's voice? <laughs> oh, a new voice. 
Um, <laughs> Shannon says as if her voices are so different. <laughs> Let me just look at my list of voices. I'll just go, let me just roll a die. <laughs> A four-sided die. Oh, yeah, she has voice number two. <laughs> um, she's like, uh, I always deliver the bread directly to Princess Hanalor. I don't understand why I can't do it now. And the guards being like, well, you know, rules have changed. The princess doesn't want to... Uh, she touched the funky spindle. She did. <laughs> the princess doesn't want to come out here and, you know, meet with you commoners and the girl is like she's asleep <laughs> the girl is like but i i always i always go into the castle i i know her like this we, is gay we i knew you were gonna say that i knew you were gonna say that and the guard's like well you're not on my list so i can't let you in <laughs> <laughs> she's like well do you Oh. Do you have, like, a supervisor or something that I can talk to, like, can someone to higher up than you? Like, th- this is just unacceptable. <laughs> um, that's pretty much what you hear. So this girl looks like a soccer mom, but 17. <laughs> no, she doesn't. I have a, do you want to see her? Yes, I do. Okay. Um, that was a different voice, guys. It was. I'm proud of you. It was. Yep, there she is. There she is. She's... Oh. Cute. Oh, cute. How do you rate Does her on a scale have... of one to ten? <laughs> She's a pretty solid seven. Okay. The other one was a three. <laughs> um, so wait. Uh, Shannon. Yeah. So what does the guard do after that? Does he just say no, or does he go and get a supervisor? <laughs> um, so there's, so there's two guards, so I think he kind of gestures at the other guard to okay. be like, you, like, keep an eye on her, and I'll go get somebody. And then he leaves. And so she's just kind of standing there impatiently. Um, she doesn't speak to the other okay. guard, but he's keeping an eye on her. Okay. Hmm. Do you guys okay. want to give this girl a name this. for me? Oh, yeah, I was just going to say, does she oh, have yeah. a name? Yeah. Her name should be... Quick. I'm looking at her. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Honestly, I hate myself. The first thing that popped into my head was Amelie. Amelie. So her name is Amelie. <laughs> no, her name can't be Amelie. No, oh, Amelie. we gotta save Amelie for someone It'll else. It'll go off the rails. Thing. Um, it's another good um, reference. Thing I thought of was uh, Angelica. Angelica. <laughs> it's Eliza. Her name can be Angelica. All right, it's Angelica now. It's Angelica. All right. And Peggy. Skyler sister. <laughs> her name is Angelica Miller. Okay. Cool. Is there a reason why her last name's Miller? Okay. The Miller sisters. Um, Well, obviously she's a Miller. She has breads. Yeah. Oh, okay. I'm not British. I don't know how these things (laughs) work. Yeah, I didn't... (laughs) Okay, so what are you doing, Dora? (laughs) You have to be English to know how to make bread. I'm going to go back to the the other three, and I'm going to be like, oh, okay. Hey, hey, guys. Guys. Yeah. Yeah. What's up? Guys. Um... One, I think I have an idea of how to get in the castle. Two, there's a girl. All right. Okay. Um, so I, I don't know. I feel like she might be, like, a good person, so maybe we should help her out. But also, I'm not sure if that would help us get in there because I have a kind of idea about how we can get in there. All right. Um, the what idea. is the idea? Okay, so, like, the guards have a list, right? That's a whole thing. He's, he was like, oh, you're not on my list, so you can't come in. Ugh, this, you know, bastard. But, um, and apparently she gives bread every day, so, like, obviously it's something to do with our spindle. I mean, maybe that's a leap, but whatever. Anyway, my point is, he has a list, and I can cast Minor Illusion, which means I can ca- cast an illusionary fake list that has our names on it ah. and we can get in there that's very a, nice that's a good plan that Dora. is a good plan Dora well, you come you up with so many good plans Dora team. like I don't <laughs> that's good let's do it um here's a question why mm-hmm. like if he's like okay you're on my list what are what are you gonna go talk to the queen about and we're like um uh, we're gonna go talk to them to the Fair. queen about You're the n- poor pepper quality All right. in the markets. 
Yes. <laughs> Just yes. I have a better suggestion for a better pepper supplier. <laughs> yeah. We're food inspectors. Yeah. There we go. I like the way you think, Marty. Nice. Thanks, Mara. <laughs> <laughs> Let's go kill somebody together. Oh Aww. boy, we uh, we were so close, y'all. Guys. We'll keep working on it. I, we'll keep working on it. Marty, we can totally kill someone together. Yeah, yeah. the car. I can still oh. hear you. <laughs> oh. <laughs> okay, so oh, are we gonna go up job. to a different? He probably has poor job. management. Do you think? What? Okay, but are, are we going to help out this girl or not? What, like, what is the story with the girl? You really didn't even explain what was going on. You just said that... Oh, uh, I'm sorry. She had some bread and she was like, I give bread to the princess every day. I can't even remember who it was actually every day, but she was like, I always see her in person. And he was like, oh, you know, I'm on the list. Well, could you get so, her on Maya. the list too? Sounds like she's in love with the princess. That's gay. Could you? <laughs> that's B, Marty. B, B. You yeah, could. We could go meet I mean, her, and then you could put her on the list. I mean, we could put her on the list, but I don't know if he'll say it now that he's already seen her. All right. But you, you know, we still could. Um, let's let's. Maybe we'll go meet her. Let's go meet her. Okay. Dora, this sounds important to you, so sure, let's do it. <laughs> So Thanks. you guys, um, can can you talk to her because you're better with people and like just ask her about a bread or something? <laughs> All right, says the woman with the high charisma. <laughs> sure, Dora, <laughs> yeah. I'll talk to her. Okay, I'm, where is she? I know, but I'm just like Ripley, so open and honest. Are three of you guys just like watching creepily as Ripley goes up to this girl to be like, yes. "Hey, <laughs> yeah, yeah, w- tell me about yeah. your bread." That's not what I'm gonna say. Okay. We're, we're that, we're that, like, that bit in Avatar where it's like, act natural, and they're all just like. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I feel like we're a lot of bits in Avatar, but yeah. that's fine. Um, I was thinking about one of the other, I was thinking about an Avatar thing, like, literally a second ago. Oh, it was the cabbages. Okay. <laughs> Um, all right. So, where is she? All right. We walk she's up. Still What's, near the gate. What, she's still just standing there? Yeah. Tapping her foot impatiently. Okay, I walk up to her and I say, hold on, give me a second to decide. I don't walk up to her yet. I'm deciding what I'm going to say. You're just standing in front of her and she's like. (laughs) No, no, I don't walk up to her yet. Um, (laughs) Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Hi, I'm terribly sorry. I don't mean to be rude, but I just noticed that. You have that bread, and it looks really nice, and I just wanted to know, are they selling it somewhere out here? Because I've been walking around, and I haven't seen any. Uh, yeah, um, my dad, it, he's kind of, like, on the edge of the market, but he, he's the miller. He sells the bread. All right. This is, this is special bread. It's for the princess, so. Oh, are you going to see the princess? Yes. Nice. I am. Uh, that's cool. Um... We're, I mean, we're actually, I'm here on a, uh, we're food inspect, my friends, my, hey guys, <laughs> I just look over because you're all just watching me. Um, Mara, like, waves. We're, early. we're just kind of, uh-huh. you know, we're just checking out the quality of all the food, and I just, okay. your bread looks nice quality, so I just wanted to tell you that and go see yeah. where that was, and also, well, we'll, we'll probably see you inside, because we're going in also. Oh, uh, are you on the list? Yeah. You have, like, an okay, wait, appointment so, with the queen? <laughs> yes, Dora. Um, I'm gonna go up to her. Mara, will you... Actually, can I just whisper to Mara? She needs to get her name. What is she doing? <laughs> <laughs> well, you don't just walk up to a random girl on the street and be like, what's your name? You do if you're gay. Yes, you do! <laughs> All right, <laughs> Yes, um, see, Ripley doesn't know. Shannon, I'm <laughs> loving your impression yeah, of a 17 year old girl. <laughs> like, yes, I am. Yes, I. Yeah, do you guys have like an appointment with the queen? About, yeah, like, well, the food? just to talk about the food and. Okay. The vegetables. But, um, I don't know, it might not be for a little bit. It's in a few minutes, but we were just, um, kind of hanging out about to go in but I saw you here and I just wanted to talk to you about your bread but it was nice meeting you um maybe we'll see no. Dora save me 
Ask her name, you fuck. Hey, hey, uh. Hi. This is my friend hey, Dora. She's. I come with... up, I come up. No, I come up, I come up, and I go, I, I'm like, oh, hey, hey, Ripley, who's this? Oh, this is, um, what was your name? Angelica Miller. Angelica Miller, she's bringing the bread to the princess. Yeah. Whoa. I'm the Miller's daughter. Ooh. But, and I've ex- oh, inspected it, it looks very quality, good to go. <laughs> what the hell is happening? Nice. Okay. <laughs> this good, that's not good, Mara, good, good times. Okay. Marty leans over to Mara Wait, and is like, um, should we so- kill someone now? <laughs> Mara, yes. <laughs> <laughs> okay, whenever you're ready. <laughs> um, I say to Angelica, um, oh, is this the guard who's who's got the list? Because well, I heard that we were supposed to be on the list. So this I, isn't know. the guard with the list. The guard with the list is going inside to get someone because I wasn't on the list, but I'm always on the list. So, Okay, well, we'll wait. We wait. <laughs> we wait for the guy to come back. Um, okay, so you guys well, we are just... We don't have a plan, you guys are just We're going in just, like, as we are, bringing the sheep. No, the... Sh- well, yes. The sheep okay, go with um, me everywhere. So, a couple minutes pass. The sheep are your, like, sniffers to <laughs> there you go. food. There you go. Um, are Mar and Marty ha- still hanging out far yeah, away? Yeah, plotting okay. murder. Yeah, it's just like, okay, so then... Murder like, bros. So then we'd shoot that guy. And then we can, like, flip over the castle. <laughs> and then we're inside. I like that Mara and Marty have bonded and become best friends over murder. <laughs> In the past Marty has two totally <laughs> forgiven Mara for trying to stab his yeah. arm. He's like, oh, that's all in the past. Marty we all try like, to stab each other's arms Marty sometimes. was like, she was trying to non-lethally stab yeah, him in like, the arm, and that's why we're best friendly, friends. Friendly play. Um, okay, so a couple minutes pass, and then the guard comes back out. The guard is not alone. With him is the princess. Ooh. In a oh very, very beautiful golden dress. Um, and Angelica looks very surprised to see her. Um, and there are a bunch of other guards with her. Um, and they... Oh, my gosh. They just kind of ignore you guys. And the first guard, the guard with the list, um, has, Dora, do your spell. I guess, like a megaphone. <laughs> um, is that what they had in the medieval ages? The medieval ages, you know? A megaphone. The megaphones, uh, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> he, like, clicks the megaphone on. Hello. <laughs> it's a magic megaphone. Can everybody hear me? <laughs> no, hold on. <laughs> like, change the sounds. <laughs> um... Uh, the princess would like to make an announcement to the market. Everybody, quiet down. Quiet down. Um, everybody kind of quiets down and is like, oh, the princess is here. What's the princess doing here? Yeah. Um, and the princess takes the megaphone and is like, um... Hello, everybody. Um, thank you all for coming out today. Someone in the back is like, I can't hear you. <laughs> I said hello, everybody. <laughs> <laughs> thank you for coming to the farmer's market today. She's also about 17. Um, uh, I just have a few announcements about taxes. They've been raised Aww. again. So, if you haven't paid your taxes, you're now under arrest. Thank you. <laughs> and then she like hands the megaphone oh off, God. and then the guards just kind of start like marching. Does she the acknowledge crowds. Angelica at all? Nope. She turns around and she walks back inside while the guards go to arrest oh my people. God. So the dress came from the spinning wheel, and now she's possessed. I don't say that. But it's in my head. Angelica's being like, wait, wait, hand alarm, wait. But the guards kind of, like, hold her back. Oh, oh my no. god. Um, oh, my god. I'm distressed over she these most likely girlfriends. And then, um... Is, is, the, um, is the guard with the list still standing there, or has he gone off? Um, he's still standing there. He's got the megaphone and the list, and he's just kind of overseeing. Okay, I cast his... my minor illusion. Okay. It's a cantrip. Okay. So... No spell slots. <laughs> spell slots. And I just spell slots. It. What are spell slots? Uh-huh. 
I just cast it like oh, ha- over his list. Uh huh. Or hang on, maybe I should wait for him to get it out. I'm like, okay, listen, bombastic, right? Like, hello, we are here to see the queen. You will have us on your list. Well, the queen is very busy right now. Um, we are arresting we a bunch of people. All right. <laughs> we have an He pulls out the list and says... We are food inspectors, sir, and we have, like, you know, words to say. Oh, excellent. Well, the queen would love an excuse to arrest more of these people. Uh, what is your name? <laughs> um, my name is Jarena Gonkaris. This excellent. is... Ripples Oni, this is Marina, <laughs> and this is Martinius. Martinius. That's me. <laughs> and, and I cast minor Illu- as he takes out the list. I cast minor illusion on it, and so it has those names on. All right. I thought uh, we were gonna uh, say like Mr. Popsalopicopolis the third. <laughs> no. Okay. It seems that you're on this list. Um, Give me a name of a guard. Sven. Brian. <laughs> Sven Brian, can you please escort these folks inside? Thank you. Um, Sven Brian. Sven Brian. Sven Brian's my new son. I'm calling him. Brian. <laughs> I'm adding him to my list. It's Sven Brian. Just we just guard. Went, a guard. What's the reference? Nothing. Nothing. I just said, said Sven, Sven and, and she said, said Brian. It's all so one word. Sven okay. Brian. Sven Brian. <laughs> Um, so Can there, he be hyphenated? There is no, no it's list. one word. Or I mean, Sven there is Brian no reference. starts to lead you guys inside. Um, you hear a lot of shouting in the market behind you as all of these people are arrested, including um, the miller, because you can hear Angelica shouting like, Hey, 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 hey! Oh, no. You can't arrest him! Oh, Angelica! Angelica. Um, and then I think she's probably arrested, too. Uh... So, yeah, you guys are led into the castle. Um, you are taken to some big double doors. Um, Sven Bryan is like, please wait here. Um, and he steps inside for a few moments. Thank you, Sven Hold Brian. on, I'm update. Okay, I'll do this later. I'll update my list later. Um, thank you. Okay, so we're waiting, right? Yep. Mm-hmm. All right. Uh, what's the okay. plan from here, Dora? Um, well, I don't know. Uh, you've got to say some stuff about food, obviously. All right. And then I d- we've got well, to find okay, an so to search. Yes, uh, but now I'm wondering if we should not be dissing on the food and getting more people thrown in prison. <laughs> Well, we don't have to be dissing, but we have to be, like... We have to find an excuse to search the castle, so maybe... Oh, shit, you know what? Routine maintenance for pest Mara? control. Yeah. That's true. But also, Mara. Yeah? You're stealthy and shit, right? Kind of. Hey, I'm stealthy. I mean, because you could... Yeah, mate, oh, okay. <laughs> When we met you, you were hiding on the table, so let's just... No, when we met him, he was trying to kill it. us in the Windy Willows Tavern, but... I know, when and we I met him, he was did. a lot more dynamic. Okay, what <laughs> if... Okay, hear me out. We what break it, off. Yeah, hear you out. Okay, go. Marty and I go be mm-hmm. stealthy in the castle, and you guys create a disturbance. Yes. Or either of you... Make good at or making we just loud, talk, annoying noises. Or we just talk to the queen, and that <laughs> will be a distraction. We'll talk to the queen. Are either of you good at making loud, annoying noises? <laughs> I mean... We can still make loud, annoying noises as well. Yeah. Okay. I was just thinking, we don't have any way of signaling. Um, um, if we see... what? Well, okay. Let, let's, let's say... You guys are going to go and try and find things. Stick together, okay? Because if you split off, then you might die, and that would just be bad. Mm -hmm. But if we see guards coming in your direction, or if if there's any kind of thing like that, we'll signal 
by making bird noises. That seems legit. Via or just really loud noises wherever way we can. Mm-hmm. Um and you you do the same like if you're in real bad trouble, can you just like squawk like a bird? <laughs> because then then like the guards will be like, What are you doing? But also if you scream, then the other people we're with will know that we're going to save you and stuff. So yeah. Nice. Cool. Alright. Sounds like a good plan to me. Cool. So go over this plan with me again. Me um, the DM. <laughs> Mar- Dora and I are gonna go talk to the queen about the health stuff. Mara and Marty are gonna search the castle, and okay. then if anyone's in trouble, we're gonna make bird noises. Just in the giant castle. <laughs> we're loud. Okay. Yeah, sure. Okay, I I've just found the conversation where me and Shannon decided about Will Smith. Oh, good. Um, and and I was like, first I was like. These are good. I I was like, um, they are Roxy Justice, clearly. And then Shannon said, lol, king and queen, Roxy Justice. And I said, yeah, Rocky and just Justicia. She said, perfect. And their children, Roxanne Juice. I said, yes, OMG. They're just Will and Jada Smith with their kids named after them, themselves. Okay, but Will Smith is the king of cartoon. It's kind of amazing. I mean, TBH. He punched an alien in the face once. Good. <laughs> Catherine meets him and is like, you punched an alien in the face once. <laughs> <laughs> yes. And now Very good. that is what they are. I'm making that the queen. That is what they are. Will a... Smith is a human and Jader is an elf and the kids are half elves. Yes, they're half elves. That's so accurate. Let me draw the Smith kids real quick. Whoops, they already dress perfectly. Um, but also, yes. <laughs> also the inspirational words that I he Shannon was like the the prince is like a speaker and stuff, and I said inspirational words and then how can mirrors be real if our eyes aren't real, which is a Jaden Smith tweet. <laughs> there you go. Anyway, yeah. we're gonna wrap up here today, guys. Sarah's gotta go to work. I yeah. gotta go to work too. I have You're not to the go. The person see who works, Sarah. I'm it feels go like it sometimes. Like it's like not like in a bad way. Just like <laughs> I'm never home, and then I come home, and people are here. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> um, I'll see you guys later. Bye. I'll see yeah. all of you listeners later. Yeah. Well, yeah. we won't. Have fun. Um, Tell your friends about Daring Fables. Please do. Tell your friends um, to commission Ingrid pay- for artwork. <laughs> We don't pay anything to advertise this show. <laughs> it's just word of mouth, so... What's the most Please. effective wor- form of advertising? Word of mouth. It's true. Alright, bye!